Indians going for their seventh straight win as they open a three-game set with the White Sox in Chi-Town. Tony Pena tried to build off his first win as a starter. Top of the first, the runner on second, nobody out. As Dribble Cabrera rips one to right, Michael Brantley scores on the RBI double. Indians strike first, one nothing. Well, Brantley stay on second, short-lived. Next batter, Shinsu Chu. The 1-1. One, one. Chu sends a drive, deep right center field. This ball is gone! And Shinsu Chu has given the Indians a 3-0 lead on his 22nd home run of the year. A two-run blast over the wall in right center. WTAM with the call. Fausto Carmona's won six straight starts against the White Sox. Bottom of the second, it's now 3-1. Brent Morell leading off and going yard. A big bang off the left field foul pole. His third of the year. White Sox pull within 1-3-2. Move to the third. Pena in trouble. Bases loaded, one out. Well, this won't help his cause. A wild pitch, so Brantley scores. Indians pad their lead 4-2. Later in the frame, it's now 5-2 after a Jason Nick sack fly. Trevor Crow tacks on more. Swung on a bouncer toward first. In the hole and into right field, a base hit. Hafner around third will score. Trevor Crow with an RBI single to right. Makes it a 6-2 to two ball game. WTAM with the call. With the lead in hand, Carmona goes to work. Bottom of the fourth, he gets Alejandro de Aza swinging. Then in the fifth with two out, Mark Tian, same result. Sixth inning, Dion Viciedo, thanks for playing. Carmona, seven Ks on the night. He gave up two runs and five hits over six innings. We move to the seventh, two on, one out, and Trevor Crow strikes again. Singles to right, Travis Hafner scores. 7-2 White Sox, and they would go on to win 7-3. Cleveland extended its season high winning streak to seven games, and Fausto Carmona won his seventh straight start against the Southsiders. Every Indian starter had at least one hit except Lou Marzin, as Drupal Cabrera led the way with three connections and two runs scored.